Alrighty guys, welcome to a new video. Today, as you can see, we're playing some Graves Jungle. I'm going to be showing you guys how to go about winning Graves games. Now, this is a lower elo Graves game, about silver 2 to gold 4 elo. The reason why we're recording this is due to popular request. Um, so I might actually do a run through like I used to do, where I'll do like, um, I say silver, fuck it's bad, silver, gold, plat, emerald, etc. And just do that again. They're kind of off cooldown. You stole fucking pingy, you rat bastards. Has to get flash. I should live. But he spam pinged and didn't move. Very, 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 uh. Good of you. Doesn't really matter, by the way, that I have this health. Um, it's like irrelevant. I'm actually in a better spot than her because I started my camp sooner. And she's probably going to expect me to recall, to be honest, which is wrong. But understandable. But yeah, if you cut your camps like well, you don't have to recall there. Go back to full health, easy peasy. We can see she just did raptors. There's any invade opportunity on her, to be honest. Me here just to keep eight stacks. I slate the big one here, of course. It's honestly not a bad situation given how the game started. Very big. You can see the Nidalee here crossing over from mid. We're actually up, you know, basically three camps on her right now. Though she did get a kill there mid. We'll also say though that kill shouldn't even exist. But not in really a bad way. It's just like, you know, when the fuck is Vladimir having prior to Jace? It's all like killing him, you know? Why the enemy team like this? Ah. Uh, bro, surely we just play this now. What? Ah. Uh, can get around the fucking wall there. How do I get out here is the question. I don't know which way he's going to come from. Okay. Um, I should let the um, Heimer die a little bit more there and then go in. Would have done that. Just needed to make sure that I was able to smite the blue and kill it and then I was able to play that fight so I'd get my health regen. And this guy, he fucked off. Nice. We'll trade that by Vlad. Really, really, you know, chaotic start to the game, guys. And one would say it's like a terrible stuff for Graves normally, but I'm actually not too unhappy. I think I just want to be in this game based off this start.
Nice. We don't really know where Nidalee is right now, but I suspect she's actually towards her top side. Oh, I would suspect her wrong. Gonna body block that because I don't want to lose my uh, crab. Really, really good. This Nidalee must not be playing her clear correctly here. Which, you know, is to our benefit. I mean, you guys are going to be playing in games all the time where the enemy jungler is not playing. Aren't drag? No way. Um. Come, 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 come. Nice. stuff. Go boys. Hopefully that hit her so she can't execute. Yeah, I think it did. Nice. Do I? Hmm. Let's do this. If I could have bought boots of Lucidity, I would have preferred them, but it's okay. Why am I going these boots? I just want to really, really snowball here. Not necessarily recommending you guys do this, but I want to show you guys what I'm doing. You know, if I'm here to like smurf or boost out of the sealer and kind of the benefits I'm getting. Even still be on this, yeah. And as you guys can see, they're just using the uh, wall jam plus Q combo to execute that. Something you guys want to be very, very, you know, privy to. I see people will make that mistake all the way up into masters. To be honest. Hell. Slot you uh, kite up that way just because you can't kite the other way. Tower there. I had a misclick there. Three level lead on the enemy JG despite, you know, what we would consider a terrible, terrible start. Ping that Nidalee's in her bot side here. Take the Herald, do our bot side quadrant, reset, go to our... I'm oh, sorry, do our top side quadrant, pardon me, reset, do our bot side quadrant. Always also guys, peeking the lanes you want to go to, pressing tab, you're always pressing tab when you're jungling just to see what item spikes people have, also count the enemy jungle at CS, and you can actually note also if you potentially don't see them on the map but you notice their jungle score went up, you can then figure out like what they've done. These things are very very important for JG tracking, I see some people like comment in the comment section sometimes about it, you know being um, unfriendly to watch or whatnot, um, it's just unfortunate, I can't change that for them. I like this fight, by the way. I'm running to it. I'm going to start pinging that I'm coming to it, but I want to spam ping here because I don't want to you know, influence him negatively. I do want to... Uh... Beautiful. Beautiful. Alright, should be a blue buff here. Maybe a blue endogromb. 
It is the blue. Comping into ward, you know. Thanks, right? It's been really toxic of me to ping my player to ward there. Love my, uh... I'm not going to drop Herald here, guys, because, you know, this high McKay lane is definitely going to push out the waves, crash, take the tower, etc. So I'm going to use it probably mid, which is, like, the least likely to take it. Also, quick little plug of coaching service up there. And then we'll continue on. Also, this game is like not a game where we really got fed at all. I mean, we only are just picking up like kills really now. Oh, one, one, five, something of that nature. Oh, I'm picking up to be careful. Nidalee is probably not me looking at him like he's a snack. <laughs> this. I know there's a drag up, but I think there's like basically zero chance of them taking drag here. So I'm not actually that concerned about it. I'd rather look to see if I can like punish this Nidalee in some way. Um, yeah, I don't know about that play by him, but anyway. Looks like, in my opinion, that Nidalee is going to her Krugs. So I'm going to hop the wall blind, see if I can just one shot her. Correct. Okay. Looks like that was watered. This guy cannot outrun me though. With these boots. I'm gonna try and kill him here before he uh, takes the wave and before the enemy wave crashes into the tower. I don't think it did. It did. Well played to him. It's a nice little tactic there. Not sure if he intentionally did that, but it's uh, definitely beneficial for him to do that. Alright, I'm gonna run mid here straight away, drop the Herald. And this is definitely. Going to uh, take the tower here, and we'll be able to siege probably the next tower too, in all honesty. And then I'll probably rotate over to uh, Nidalee's Raptors plus red buff. But it maybe bot lane doesn't do anything too crazy here. It's that. I'm actually just going to wrap up now. Oh, fuck that out. That's that. Alrighty guys, well it looks like they've given up. Excellent stuff. As always, if you guys are interested in coaching, feel free to check out the coaching at coachmarga.com. And in the coming days, I will probably be releasing, you know, like a gold um plat. Um gold plat, emeralds, and then I don't know if I'll release another diamond game since I released like my last graves video, it's like D2 Monsters game. But I might it actually did quite well, you know, for especially for Elo. Normally people don't like watching um, that Elo bracket, but they did that video, so we might release more. Alright, I'm gonna do these two bots I camps recall. <laughs> Enemy team uh, doing a little bit of typing, of course. Usual stuff. Alright, let's reset here. Collector, long sword, top side. Take this, take second herald, and then end off that. If they don't FF in the meantime. If I ghost blade here, I'm surprised that Nilly went back that way. I'll lie to you guys. Might kill this guy. Oh, he missed that. Alright, let me go back. Up over the wall, do the Herald. Try to end this game. Don't want to waste any of you guys' time. I want to show you. 
I'll show you guys how to uh, end as quickly and efficiently as possible. All right, beautiful. So I'll quickly show you guys the runes here again, and I will mention once again that this was the silver to gold, um, you know, version of this, I guess. And that in the coming days, like the next Graves videos, I'm not sure when the next Graves videos will be, but the next Graves videos you should see will probably be, you know, just slightly above the ceiling. Um, right, load. I guess also I'll mention that if you guys are interested in, you know, improving faster and, you know, having the guidance to actually know exactly what you need to do to climb, you know, instead of kind of guessing, watching videos, trying to figure it out yourself, feel free to jump into Magus University. Had a lot of people join from the YouTube now. Um, sometimes there's a link in the description with a discount. I don't know if there will be in this video or not, but you can also check old videos and just, you know, if you find a description code, uh, sorry, a, a discount code, you link it. But yeah you guys want to uh join that community submit your games get them reviewed know exactly what you're doing wrong and what you need to do to win more games and improve feel free to join Mike's university look forward to seeing some new faces there here's the runes um wouldn't really change anything here guys so that's it for today until next time take care good luck on the rift peace out